In this video, I want to talk to you about DNS enumeration. Now, don't forget to check out all the videos on DNS. I have some really good videos on how to use uh, DIG and um, NSLOOKUP, and there's a variety of DNS interrogation tools that Kali offers. So you have Kali Linux, Information Gathering, DNS Analysis. So you have DNS Dictionary Attacks, DNS Enum, DNS Map, DNS Recon, uh, DNS Walker, Maltigo, NMAP, and of course the front end for NMAP, um, ZenMap. So we're going to demonstrate DNS enumeration here. And DNS enumeration is a really, really easy tool, and it gives you a nice little report. Uh, you can do all of this manually, but, you know, why do it manually when you can just, uh, you know, have an automated tool do it for you? So we're going to do a DNS ENUM against our, our, our host, which in this case is going to be vernet.com, and we're just going to let this run. Okay? So in this case... What you can see is, you know, that it's basically a script that runs. Uh, it says vernet.com. Here's the host address. So you can see the records, and these are all public addresses. So it went outside of the world and grabbed the real vernet.com. Then you've got the name servers, you know, dsredirection.com on a different network than the 208. So they may be close to each other, but they're still on different networks. Uh, the mail servers, if it could find it. Um, Zone transfers, if you can find it, so it's trying the zone transfer for vernet.com on the name server, and it basically says that the query has failed. Um, and if you were able to, which is realistically what should happen from a defensive point of view, but let's say that, for example, from example vernet.com was bad uh, or misconfigured or had vulnerabilities, then we would basically get that zone table right here. Um, then also bind version, server failed. Well, it's not a particular bind uh, DNS. Uh, also couldn't get a zone transfer from the secondary name server easy uh, either. And it uh, gives us a little summary basically at the end. So the cool part is, is when you run this tool, you get a summary of what hosts, what name servers, what mail servers. And I like this uh, and a zone transfer. So well, the reason why I like this tool is because instead of basically doing four separate commands, you run one command and it gives you four separate results. So this is DNS enumeration. It's a DNS interrogation tool. It's relatively easy to use. Um, I'll uh, show you guys one more thing, DNS enum. If you just type in DNS enum here, don't forget you can look at some of the other advanced options of this. It's really easy just to do a sanity check and point it against your host. But if you want to get a little creative with this, you certainly can do this. Okay, you can have verbose output. Um, you can do the number of Google pages to process. Uh, so it does have some pretty... Pretty interesting advanced uh, features here. Maybe I'll cover that in a later video. But for now, I just want to show you, hey, we always run our tool. We do our help file. We run it against the target. We get our output. We document that. And then we move on to the next test. And then once you have all of your tests in one place, then you can go back through, make sense out of all of your reports, and then find out realistically what parts you want to pursue, you know, and how you can't tweak those reports to make sense. So my name is Leo Dreger. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to check us out on Facebook, LinkedIn, YouTube, and Twitter.